everyone, I'm Amanda from Amanda Lynn Plans. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be putting a little bit of washi tape in my daily section for the month of January. In my dailies this year, I'm using it more like a journal with just really minimal stickers and washi tape. I want it to be more like something I set up at the beginning of the month and then I can add like quote stickers as I need. So I have a bunch of my quote stickers here in my reusable sticker book that I keep in the back of my planner. So those are really accessible for me as I'm doing my journaling, but I thought it would be fun to go through. I've already done a couple of days, but I thought it would be fun to go through and put some washi tape down, maybe just around the edges, just to add some fun and brighten it up a little bit. This is the washi tape from the January subscription box. January 10th is the last day to subscribe to the box and to receive this snowflake design. I'm also using it in my weekly section this month, so it's fun that I'm gonna be using this washi tape all month long here in my dailies. I don't want this to have rules, so I'm just gonna go through and kind of cover up some stuff here and there. Just rip it kind of random. This is just for a fun little extra touch of color. I can get in such a rut when it comes to my planning. And I think that partially because I know what works for me and I don't want to mess it up, I guess. So let me know if you can relate to that. I will, like I mentioned, be going through with some quote stickers too. So it will be more than just this washi tape, but this will allow me to be able to focus on the journaling aspect whenever it comes time that part of the day instead of having to worry about decorating it and journaling. If I already have some stuff down, it just makes it a little bit easier to actually accomplish it. <laughs> Maybe you can relate to that, let me know. Also, I might feel inspired to go and add some more washi tape later. Who knows? But I am trying to keep a little bit of the bulk down this year. We'll kind of see how that goes. I do love a chunky planner at the end of the year, so I might <laughs> I might change my mind and go back and add some more. We'll just have to kind of see. And now that I'm thinking this through, I might just do half of the month and then see how this is working for me. And then at some point I can finish out the rest of the month, but here's what it looks like so far. Really minimal, just gives it a little bit of extra color. And I have been using my fountain pen and it's a color that matches somewhat. So that'll be fun too. I'd love to know what you do in your daily section. Do you use it for your to-do lists? Do you use it to journal? I'd love to know down in the comments. As always, thank you so much for watching. Until next time.